I'm here at Q Theatre to interview the Auckland Philharmonia, but there's something that's making me feel really uneasy about this. <laughs> it was these guys creeping me out. Musicians. Getting ready for your big spooky show? Yeah, Halloween. Big favourite holiday of mine, yeah. Now you're going to walk me through how you create the scary sounds for Hocus Pocus in concert. Yeah. We're going to take basically normal instruments that we hear all the time, but we're going to play them in ways that are unfamiliar. And one thing that percussionists don't use very often is a bow. <laughs> These are super balls. You know the kinds you like get in the machines? Like a bouncy ball. Yeah, yeah. You cut the bouncy ball in half and put it on an old knitting needle, okay. and then you can use it to rub across things. It's called the water phone. There is water inside of it. Basically, scary sounds, from what we understand science-wise, is that humans are very comfortable with the speaking voice and that moderate range. So anything that's outside of that range makes us really uncomfortable. Yeah, it's quite high, it's a little bit grating on the ears. <gasps> One last effect that we also do, which can be a little bit annoying, is when we play right on the bridge. Does it give you the tingles still when you hear those high sounds? Yeah, definitely. I mean, I think my own instruments is kind of annoying to listen to sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> the most common thing that you hear, and this is a reference in lots of music and tons of movies, is what's called the dies irae. Okay. And it's like an old oh, yeah. Roman chant, and the dies irae translates to like day of wrath. I gotta practice. Okay, yep, fair enough. <laughs> All right, uh, thank you very much. <laughs> I feel like we've been conditioned as well, like the DA Scare, where they played it all those movies, we've been conditioned. But that's a scary part of the movie, right? Something so you prepare yourself. Happen. Can't um, really hear you, Corbett, because that witch behind yeah. us. Yeah, cackling witch, also a scary sound. One thing that they didn't really talk about, but I guess it sort of falls into it's a bit different from that um, adult speaking voice, yeah. is like little creepy children ah, singing, singing nursery rhymes. little songs. So you mean it's just children? There's <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> a fine line between a lullaby and then a haunting song. Yeah. I think it's all in the blinking, you know. You know. <laughs> oh, goodbye, baby. <laughs> you got to blink. To, uh, well, you know. Thanks to the team from the Auckland Philharmonia. They're going to perform the score to Hocus Pocus tonight at the Artea Centre.